I became not only the physician who was consulted to tell dying people they were dying, but I also had to deliver the news that their loved ones could not be at bedside. And I began to experience something called moral distress, which is when you're feeling compelled to do something that goes against your ethic. And that actually led to compassion fatigue, and it's widespread in the medical industry. Uh, particularly ICU nurses suffer with it the most, and it usually leads to only three outcomes. One is you just really become an old curmudgeon. You stay in the industry and nobody likes working with you and the patients don't like you. Two is you make an error. And by the way, medication error is still the third leading cause of death. Pharmaceutical drug error is still the third leading, leading cause of death in this country. And then the third outcome is um, if you suffer compassion fatigue long enough, you usually take your own life. And so I decided that none of those options were good enough for me. I took a sabbatical and I decided to leverage my unique board certified training in integrative and holistic medicine for the benefit of the Chattanooga area. As there is no true board certified integrative and holistic physician, not an MD in town. And I came to Ed and asked him if he would like to partner and his response was, I've been waiting for 40 years for someone like you to want to partner out in the open. And we created a collaboration with Nutrition World because the simple reality is the people who already seek out support and education and clarity from Nutrition World are exactly the types of clients with whom I work well. And the idea I've come up with is to simply try to be a reliable exit strategy out of the sick care system.